Back at home, what has the Tory Control Council in Barnet announced recently? Oh, yes. Basically, that Barnet Council have said that they want to try and streamline their services like a budget airline. And you think, well, that's a stupid idea, isn't it? Because let's face it, budget airlines most people regard as crap. <laughs> you can basically go on Ryanair now, you're supposed to have to pay a quid, aren't you, for the toilet. <laughs> And you're thinking often you've only spent a quid for the actual flight itself. <laughs> You'll be there having a dump thinking, this better be a good one. <laughs> I could have got a return ticket for this. You'd sort of be weighing it up, wouldn't you? Going, is this one worth a pound? <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, this feels like it's going to do 20 quids worth of damage. Let's go. <laughs> The, the Tories, for being a market party, have never understood the market. So they think if something's successful and sells well, people love it. You know, they don't, they tolerate things. You know, I shit three times a day. I don't love it. <laughs> and we all have a, you, know, you know that's too many. That's too long. I've been to, I've been to Barnet. Of all the places, like, if you're going to do a no-frills government, at least do it somewhere that had frills in the first place. I mean, taking frills out of Barnet is like taking the charisma out of Milton Keynes. It's... <laughs>